welcome back. Today we're going over my top three ways to read who's the most influential person in the room. This is not based on behavioral science, it's based on my own experiences. Hack number one to determine who might be the most influential person in a group in a room. If it's a work or professional setting, whoever the boss ends up looking at the most when they're speaking in a group of people. It's usually that they're trying to influence that person. So whoever's in charge, whoever's the supervisor, the person that they look at the most is probably one of the most influential people in the room. Now my second tip to determine who might be the most influential person in a meeting or in a room is that when everyone's laughing, people tend to look at one person for their reaction. So if that one person's laughing and people are looking to that person to see their reaction, it means that person might be the most influential person in that meeting or in that room. Now, my third indication is actually the opposite. How to determine who might be the least influential in a room is that they're constantly seeking approval in a meeting. They're nodding their head over and over again very frequently. So it appears as though they're a little bit too eager and overzealous to agree, which might mean they're just being a subordinate and just being a yes man. So the person who's constantly nodding your head too much it often gives away that they're the subordinate or they're trying to please someone a little bit too much. So they're my top three ways to read the room and try to determine who has the most influence.